Hey everybody, Mark Spectre Comics, and I'm back. This time, I got a cool mail call, a few packages that came in the mail within the last week or so, just haven't had a time to unbox. Do you guys want to see what I got? Stay tuned. So I'm back. So. Like I said, I got a cool uh, bunch of packages here. It's been sitting here for, I don't know, about a week or so. And um, haven't had a time, been pretty busy with work and obviously personal stuff. So I just haven't had the time to record anything um, outside of my previous video. But um, had some time tonight to make this video. So quick mail call, show you the stuff. And then uh, got a cool package coming in, hopefully, next week. Ended up picking up one of my uh, 2021 gold books, so uh, stay tuned for that. We'll do a nice little live unboxing. So, um, start with the first one. Ended up uh, getting this from a community member on uh, Steve's channel, Bird 54 Comics. Ended up getting this from my buddy Mark. He had ordered a bunch of uh, t-shirts for his channel, Legion of Comics. So that came in today. Well, came in last week, but uh, opening it today. So, uh, boom. Look at that. Nice little t-shirt. Fits nice. There you go. We are Legion. Cheers to that. So, great shirt. Looks amazing. And it fits well. There you go. So, um, next thing I got. Uh, this. So, this is a funny thing. So, this next package was, um, what am I going to say? It was a store exclusive. So, I don't usually buy store exclusives. I limit myself to maybe one or two a year. Because um, I don't, you know. Don't want to pay all that extra money for uh, for like a virgin variant or anything. I just don't really think it's worth it. But um, I did see this really cool cover for a story that I've been reading pretty much th through and through. And uh, so I picked this up. And funny thing is, I ended up set um, sent to almost an identical address I had, but it went to like. Instead of going to Ave, I went to the street. So I got messaged from uh, uh, the guy that same day it came in. And I was like, oh, you know, got a package I think that's for you. And, you know, my wife opened it up and saw it was a comic. So I was like, oh, it's not something I ordered. <laughs> so uh, if you have time, you know, swing by and pick it up. So I ended up picking it up right after work chatted with the guy and you know he ended up saying he uh had a buddy who was like a big dealer on the east coast so i was like oh it's pretty cool so we chatted it up for like a, you know 10 minutes or so and then i went home so uh this was the book this is from uh something is killed in the children this is issue 15 this is from the i forget what store exclusive it is but uh it's a really nice cover you know and um, I believe it was limited to either 300 or 500 and it ended up selling out I believe that same day so it was a nice cover I like the uh, contrast there with the black black and white and then just that little bit of red with the um, blood spill there on the bottom so that was really cool and um, the last book was like I said I only get one or two store exclusives a year really and uh, this one ended up coming from uh, my buddy Steve from uh, Burke Family 54 Comics. So, uh, as you guys know, he had his first, um, you know, store exclusive for Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. So I was like, oh, I gotta, I gotta get this. You know, I gotta support the comic fan. And. Uh, this is the book that came in. So uh, I have not been reading the uh, current run 
I've heard only good good stuff from the uh, from the community, especially when they do the uh, Thursday night chats and we do the comic book reviews. But there's just you know so many books out there. It's just really tough to uh, catch up on the reading. So, but I definitely have to you know start reading it. And he did a okay me some books you know not too long ago. And it had some Power Ranger books and uh, with the Lord Dragon run. So that was. Uh, those were some great books. So I'm opening this up. There we go. Got this package here. Got some pull tabs. There we go. Says uh, Mark Spectre Comics. So uh, oh, he wrote a little note on here too. All right. I'll read the note first. It says uh, thank you so much for buying a Burt fan variant. As a thank you, I have included an extra book. Oh, nice. That's awesome. You didn't have to do that. Um, hope you enjoy both. And thanks for all the support. Steve, Berg Family 54 Comics, hashtag Team No Sleeves. Go, go Cats, Cowabunga, and it's morphin' time. That's cool. I like to keep these notes. Um, got a little, uh, little collection going on there. In the uh, in the comic room, so I'm just gonna open this up, and uh, this is probably the time when you do the little fast forwarding. Like I said, he threw in an extra book. Oh, this is cool. I actually did not have this book, and he knew I'm a Flash fan. So uh, this is really cool. This is um, Flash Rebirth, issue number one. Very nice. That's awesome. That's a great cover. Thanks, Steve. And, of course, here's the book. Is that Mighty Morphin, issue number four, that big reveal of the Green Ranger. I have not read it, so uh, do not spoil it in the comments below. <laughs> and uh, this cover is just absolutely amazing. Love that cover. And uh, let's see. So... Uh, there you go, Mighty Morphin issue number four. And in the back, you can see there it has his uh, has his logo there right on top. That's awesome. Beautiful copy. Yeah, look, look at that artwork. Amazing. So. Uh, that's that. That's a quick little mail call. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, it's Mark's with the Comics. Out.